Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to continue with uh, Achilles Legends Untold. Uh, last time we did some tests. I was giving some thoughts about the game, you know. Like I said, I think the game is getting pretty boring right now. But uh, maybe we'll get better. Let's uh, let's continue with the main quest. that you got yourself into some trouble again. The master sent me to search for a very durable raw material. I asked around and a certain former friend told me I can find it in the ruins near my sea. No sooner had I gone inside than a scorpion jumped on me. A huge, ugly one. I barely made it out alive. Do you always have to wander around ruins and wake huge scorpions up? Ah. Where will I find it? In a rocky canyon near the fishing spot. Surely you'll find it. When you take care of him, bring me a few pieces of its armor. They may come in handy for Master's new project. Okay, so Firtos got again into troubles with some scorpions. But he said this one is bigger, so hopefully you're gonna fight a better boss. You know, I just hope. We're gonna find some hard boss with some tough mechanics, you know what I mean? So, um, but I'm not gonna explore the map anymore because apparently the game is sending us to all the location. The main quest basically is sending you all over the map, so it's kind of pointless. As soon as we finish com fully this map, uh, we can come back, you know. I still wanna fight this motherfucker. I think on the end of the video we're gonna we're gonna fight that one. This is the guy who almost killed us in a previous episode, so But he was invisible, now we can see him, so let's go fuck him up. Uh yeah, let's move on with the quest. I can actually go back here I guess. But I don't know, we'll see. Yeah, uh, let's teleport. Thinking here will be the best place to teleport. Yeah. Sorry for my voice is a bit uh, a bit fucked up, but um, hopefully we'll get better. We get some nasty cold and uh, or flu. It is pretty pretty annoying, you know. first because we have this shit here it was from what i remember it was like a outpost tower or something like that you know skeleton yeah but these ones are like so weak now i'm still using dual wielding dual wielding is by far the best i think for the time being at least, I don't know. Maybe later on we're gonna just shift into a two-hand sword. We're gonna we're gonna see. The thing is I need way more energy, you know, because that two-hand sword is consuming like a lot of energy, you know. Got the X. A sixty-six. I hate the weapon comparison tab, I hate, I, I don't know, it's like, this one needs a quick fix, you know. I don't know what they are doing, I don't know what the developers are doing, but they didn't patch this game, and this game is like, I already lost, like, some materials to upgrade this weapon, just to realize it's worse than this one, because see, the stat is telling you it's better than the other one, yeah? Even if it's on level 4. Basically, the damage is increased, but it's not. Trust me, the damage is not better. Because if I'm attacking and I'm checking again the weapon, I'm saying again, nah, this is bullshit, bro. This is not. This is not the real. They are not the real numbers. You know what I mean? If you want, I can equip this one, and you're gonna see it's like. Let me 
Let me put this one in. Yeah, but this one has like a 80. This one is worse. Check the numbers on this. Even if this one is telling us it's like better. I'm going to attack once. And check the numbers now. See 104 from 145. And this is way better. Just because it's like. Let me equip it. Let's check again the number on it. Let's attack. Let's check again the number on it. It's staying the same. This one dropped. You know what I mean? It's... This is a bit confusing for everyone, you know, because maybe you're going to consider, like, changing weapons and, you know, just give it, like, a try to different weapons, just upgrade your, your like, uh, weapons you are using and things like that, you know. But it's, uh, it's not really working like that. It's awkward. It's extremely awkward. Because, for example, it made it made me invest like I have I upgraded like four times. I wasted a lot of bronze fragments just on that weapon. And uh, just realized it's shittier than what I I'm using right now, basically. So many enemies here. They're just skeletons. They're not something which you need to consider like a danger but you can they can kill you know on this age people i don't think so but I can sense a here. still like careful with them you know what is wrong with these motherfuckers why are they running i can see a shrine see your shrine now Okay, we poisoned him. Yes. Yes. Finished the... Uh, we completed the lion. Basically, we can go back on stacking HP. I'm gonna explore a bit, you know. The, I'm not gonna. I, I'm not gonna explore like crazy. I'm not gonna start walking all around the map because anyway, the main quest is sending you to some some of these locations. Motherfucker is doing a lot of damage, yeah, because it's a two-hand It's a two-hand. It's a dual wielder. Sorry, <laughs> I'm still calling dual wielders like. Depends. I don't know why. Can, uh, be retard. Not a lot, but. See him, boys. So how that fucker stunned me? This motherfucker stunned off me, and uh, allowed the other one just to hit me. Five that okay. See, she's normal. She's the only one which is like normal. The symbols must be the key to opening that chest. Because previously, when I was like walking and fighting, even if I was fighting next, to, yeah, let's test this. Get the horse, son. Okay. Not yet. I managed to break that just with the stomp. Let's test it again. Yeah, the stomp works. So we need to find one more. Some nice weapon will drop in this one. 
You have some divine. Divine. Actually, it's not causing burn. Because I don't see like causing burn, but it has better overall damage. Let me equip this just to test it for a while. Tuck your tail and run! Something big must have Oh fuck, it's another guy. They are no threat for us anymore. Still though, let me <laughs> let me use the potion. He can knock me down like it's, you see it's knocking you down like So get the fuck out. Apparently we have a overall better damage, I think. Yes to the cursed live uh, beings, we are like doing extra damage with the divine. I don't know, I bet I think so. Anyway, number wise, this game is pretty fucked up, I'm telling you. In this one you don't have a map, but usually the sellers are like having a couple of rooms, nothing too fancy. Yeah, so the weapon is not causing burn. If it was causing burn, this one would like... Because I saw the skeletons are set to on fire like instantly, the same as Bran. Almost instantly. Dark crystal. I think in like twenty more levels, I'm gonna break the game like so bad. Because our health pool will be like, bro, no one can take us down anymore. And trust me, on 40 levels, you can do whatever you want on your... Because it will be like, insanely amount of each. From what I saw yesterday, I think we're gonna get on like around 2.5k. But I'm still considering to invest some points into a... Show you. I'm still considering investing some points into this guy. Just because it's unlocking an additional slot for special weapon skills. So basically we're gonna have an extra skill. Because right now uh, we have just one skill which we are using. And uh, because we have this, we are like recovering fury so easily. We don't need to use any potions. And most of the time I'm on 100, you know. So I'm, I prefer to use some skills at least, you know, to just... Because it's pointless to have it full. I, I can use that buff, even though it's annoying. But I can still use it for extra damage and issues like that. Skeletons are easy. The 
traces stop at this gate. I should check this ruins out. <laughs> So see that's the that's the thing with the game. Basically all the all the fights will look the same. That's what I, I'm I don't like about it. Because most of the fights will look exactly the same. And it's getting me extremely bored, I ain't gonna be honest with you. Because what you need to do, you just run, use a use a heavy, basically use this. And after that if you fight a big bad motherfucker. You're gonna need to dodge out as soon as possible. It's like uh, you're finding it really challenging at all. So my voice is cranking up. Let's see. We have another. Seller. Sorry for the breaks I'm doing while I'm talking like But suddenly I'm seeing some enemies and I'm trying to see what should I prioritize I'm, not, I'm good at multitasking but not extremely good at multitasking I guess Hopefully this will improve my uh, yeah. Ability to multitask I, I hope I'm gonna do it way better we still have some skill points to invest right now. We have like two of them. All of this. Go out. Let's see what the fuck we have around here. Nothing important. You should know. <laughs> The other motherfucker went. That's right. I Look at him, bro. Look at him, guys. He was like just going, going around, circling. Some gold. Keep going. With Apparently, there should be a connection in between this area, but we're gonna do it when we're gonna unlock that, yeah. Don't explore that shit. Let's just go and have a look, because I think I, I already unlocked that path. The lights are just shredding to it. This will be easier than I thought. Another rest. Yeah. We can build. We can craft traps now. I'm really curious how traps are working because uh, usually I like. It's like some consumable item which you just drop it on the ground and maybe will knock down enemies. It can be very useful. Son of a bitch. 
so hiding behind that fucking logs like this woman is crazy she wanna die Kill the bastard. Kill the bastard. I don't know. Even their lines are like getting annoying right now because it's like we're like fucking six, seven hours in the game and they are like repeating themselves. Like we've been exploring this. Fuck it, I missed that. <laughs> it's nice because you can fall down, but... Curious, what, what is this? Divine Crystal, okay. I don't know if it, was, if it really was worthy. I don't know what, you, what uh, the purpose of the crystals are. I think maybe upgrading weapons. Some weapons with the special effect, like... Let's unlock this and go straight into the old temple he mentioned. So, all of this one. This. Need one, one more point. I don't understand what I'm missing here. Oh, okay. Yeah, so now crits will fully restore energy. This is a nice thing, but I, I'm not seeing crits often, you know what I mean? Can use this one. Right? Yeah, so at, at least now the mana, the it's called fury in this one. I can like drain it a bit. Combining both of them. Like a pretty straight. I think one. no one has been here for a long time. The scorpion must be somewhere here. Uh, Firtos told us here should be a giant scorpion left. Very curious. I hope it is a boss fight and it has some interesting mechanics, you know what I mean? Because till now we fought only basic bosses like I don't know if I should stop the fight then. Or I can just walk. I'm always forgetting about the second attack. But at least we are able to see through the environment. Very true, right now, I really don't give a shit about getting hit. I can, like, easily trade damage with them because I don't give a fuck about it. It's like the game just it's just too easy now. And I'm I, I'm just completely honest is like we are on the hardest difficulty.
This game is easy as well. You can see I'm prioritizing like barrels instead of enemies, so you can see I really don't give a shit about enemies anymore. Maybe some bosses will be like challenging, I hope so. Because like I said before, if you have like 10 enemies, yeah, you should prioritize enemies because... But you need to be extremely careful, yeah. But uh, if it's just one of them, you can go make your coffee, you know, brew coffee, prepare something to eat. But this game has zero challenge. And you're gonna see now that the, this boss will gonna kill us, you know, the, the the big scorpion will gonna kill us. That will be like... Actually, the path is telling us to go through there, so that's that's the main path, I guess. So let's, let's move on to the other one, explore this. Skeleton King, right? He can do some damage. I know he can. But now, because we are like. Uh, as soon as we kill an enemy, we, regener we regenerate some HP. You don't really feel it, right? Like. I'm gonna make a guide as soon as we finish this map. I hope the next one will be like better. Yeah, guy. Let's start by skeleton. They are quite a few. Pretty dark in this one. It was nice if they were like putting more sources of light in this dungeon, at least some fucking torches and things, you know. Another one here. Yeah. Oh, this motherfucker has some damage. looks friendly or not or he's just sitting there see like more of these braziers or some shit you know like sources of light because I like the I like the god ray and all that things but it's pretty dark in this one This one I recommend you to, is what I'm doing basically, I'm running around them, I'm trying to don't dodge so I can just heavy attack them. Supposed to, to do like a running game there, but, but I missed it. I'm still missing the timing, you know, because basically you need to do this, you know, so 
start running and attack, heavy attack. But sometimes my guy is like not really reacting to my space bar, you know? Because I'm pressing space to run, so. Sometimes he's like a bit uh, low. Or maybe I'm not checking the energy properly. can go back to the the main path like I really hope that this boss will be like sick Let's break everything down. This monstrosity down. must have hidden deep down. Hmm. Oh, we are like this. Ready for them, bro. Like, so fucking easy. Then sisters basically just grieved it hard. Not to have escaped death. Though we have lost our dear comrades. I wonder what the author meant. The statues are looking decent, I'm not gonna complain. The statues of lions, bro, some of them are shit yet. I'm gonna I'm gonna point it out when I'm seeing one. Because they look like shit. Not all of them, I guess. Because maybe we're gonna find some good ones. But some of them are just shit. Look, I, I saw that one. It's like it, that one was looking decent. I know I'm going back. This one is looking decent, you know. This is, looks like a proper lion, yeah. As soon as I'm gonna find a shitty one, I'm gonna let you know. And in comparison with that one, it's just pathetic. You know? Yeah, see his tail. <laughs> okay, so the scorpion is there. No, he didn't. He didn't charge on me. So basically, I like just. Okay, let's see his moves because I'm not gonna attack him till I just wanna see what he can do. Like come on bro. This is like the basic scorpion. He's doing like the same. Till now I was like just attacking with this these pinchers. Come on bro. Okay, this one looks... The normal scorpions have that ones as well, so... But this one is like... Wider. And you have another set of horns coming out. see something like some sick attack move from me. into the light one and I like it because he has some armor plates on him he's looking badass but he's not really I don't know Till now, basically, he has the same attack moves 
Yeah, that one has like another set of thorns around it. But... And he is a hugger too. Just throwing. <laughs> Come on, bro. I want to see like something, some, some, some nice attack. This is all what he can do. He can kill this boss policy. Yeah, he has the, the chain attack. Like three attacks, no chain together, but it's kind of the same as the normal Scorpion, you know what I mean? It's like just. He's slightly bigger, <laughs> that's the only thing with this guy. Okay, he can do that. He can, he can. That's what a normal Scorpion is doing as well. Just staying close to him to make him do some, some attacks, but I see he's just using the pinchers like the other one. He can do this as well. But I'm not seeing nothing different, you know what I mean? I was hoping that the other legs will do something, will send some spikes around him or something. You know, like 360. I swear to god, this is like... This is lame, bro. This is fucking lame. I'm not gonna kill him, I'm still waiting because maybe on the when he's low HP he'll gonna enrage or do something. Yeah. He has he has the normal chain attack. Come on, you are on one HP. Get enraged, do something my friend. Okay, this one looks nice. I won't say no to that, but he can hug as well. Calling that a hug just because he's like using both pinchers, you know, like <laughs> to snap you, but it's looking like he's ha hugging, you know. Um, this is the, the only nice attack he has, but the, all the scorpions have the same attack. Yeah, fuck this shit. Yeah, what to say about it? I'm extremely disappointed. This was basically, and I'm not going, I'm not even funny now. This was basically. A uh, normal scorpion, just on a no slightly bigger, uh, looking a bit more badass because he had the armor plates and all that shits on him. But nothing must be the key to opening that impressive. Chest. Like they could put some extra skills on him at least. You know what I mean? Like do a 360 thorns, you know, that armor, I don't know, just... I don't know, I, I can I, I can think on so many things to add to this guy. Just to make it more like lethal, you know, do a charge, you know, charge me, you know, because if he was charging me, he wasn't basically... I was, I was, even if I was rolling out, he was like closing distance. Do a charge attack, do something like a bite, do something like a sting, do something because he has that fucking tail, you know, what the fuck? It's... <laughs> I don't know. The game is ridiculous, like... When you fight one single enemy, this game it's a joke. One on one fights are just a joke. I, swear to God. And I don't want to shit on this game, but... This game shit on on itself, you know, it's not, it's not I'm shitting on it. Okay, another spear shit, okay, let me see if I have any spears, but I don't think so. Don't have, I'm gonna test that skill later on. Because the skill is called Thorns, you know, so I'm thinking maybe we're gonna summon some badass Thorns. And this is like a bit 
annoying, you know, sometimes you try to run and you get stuck in this, see? Now I'm running, but my character is stuck on that. I don't like that shit, it's... This, but... We have the unstuck button. Which is by far the best button in the game. And by far is like the best implemented one, you know? Is most of the unstuck buttons are shit. It's been a while since this I one, it's bastard. extremely, extremely good, because it's basically not not teleporting you back to the last shrine, you know. It's not respawning all the enemies around you and all that shit. It's just pulling you out from that. Another skill, so of that. I'm thinking to go. I don't know, guys, because I want to see more crits. We have we unlocked this basically. Each critical hit will fully restore energy. I don't know if luck has something to do with energy. This is nice because, but this is good to pick on the first, on the beginning of the game basically. Because you're gonna squeeze more experience. And if you go fully on this, you're gonna spend like 8 points. And uh, you're gonna get like extra experience. I think like 25. Because maybe this is a 10 and maybe this is a 15. I don't know what to say about it, but now I'm thinking to invest into luck. Because maybe luck. It's not increasing just the chance of looting items from defeating enemies and because in most games most of the games luck is like giving you, you know critical chance giving you critical damage and all that bullshit let's go to this one how many points we can use one two three four so yeah let's spend four points in this I'm not doing it for the... I'm not really doing it for this. But this will be handy, I guess. But I'm doing it for the crit chance. I really want to see like a... Increased critical chance. Because I saw the weapons have like... Look, if you check, uh, check each weapon... Have like a crit chance, you know? 10% and the damage is 100%. Okay. Usually axes have... Some of the axes have a better chance, see? And even the, the crit damage is increased. But some of the axes have like 5. So I guess heavier the axe is, lower the crit chance. And this is a total bullshit, you know? It's comparing it with what weapon? With this one? I think it's comparing it with this. Not with this one, because this one is like... Comparing it with this one. Oh, okay, I think I understand how to compare weapons. Wait a second. So if I'm pressing on this one, okay. So basically, it's comparing the weapons with the weapon you clicked on, but I bet it's still fucked up. I don't want to do more tests on this now because I'm I, I was doing like plenty of tests and I saw how the damage is dropping, how the numbers are dropping. It's just ridiculous and I don't want to put myself in this. Okay, so we can go back to the smith. Because we unlocked everything on this one. So let's just teleport there because I'm sick of walking. Let's 
shit because when you teleport is respawning all the enemies but fuck it I'm just gonna run straight through there look see this motherfucker he has the same attack moves as the boss one two one two three he can jump as well he can send portals as well come on bro he can do this he can go underground like the other one I see no difference in between them the damage is slightly lower but yeah what what can you expect that one was like a boss you know what I mean yeah the damage is slightly lower it's not like a lot lower Because that, uh, that Scorpion King, I let him like knock me down. And when he knocked me down, he dropped like, let's say 20% of my HP. Where the fuck this guy went? I don't know where the blacksmith is now. For fuck's sake. Wanted to upgrade some weapons, but... The Scorpion is no more. Thanks. You've saved my life for the second time already. If that monstrosity wandered off here, I don't even want to think about what it would do to me. I see you managed to get armor pieces from that monster. Take them to my master. He'll know what to do with them. You'll find him in our new workshop, not far from here. I almost forgot. Take these few trinkets as a token of my gratitude. I'm sure they will be of more use to you than me. Okay. Another thing which we miss, it was this, this rift over here, if you remember. Because, okay, well, let's go to, uh, he said his master has a new workshop. So let's visit him on his new place. And after we're gonna go for that one. I hate this map because it's not... I don't hate it. This map it's decent because you can use it to guide yourself, you know, to see where, you, what direction, direction you need to go, you know. But in the same time, put it like this, you don't see like a lot on this map. It was nice to zoom it out at least. Not a lot, not by a lot. Zoom it out at least two times more than this. And this could be extremely handy. Look, this guy is doing like the same amount of damage as the fucking Scorpion King. Something's here. If only I could take a closer look. Two of them, some skeletons as well. Well, you are knocked down if you don't. Let's make them hit the bell. Oh no, they are grabbing the bell. What the fuck? What the fuck? I thought they can grab just skeletons, but apparently they grab barrels as well. Got more bronze fragments. They stun locked me there, but I was just spamming. I was so lucky. I was in between them. What I basically did, I pressed Q so I denied all the damage which is coming towards me. Because when you press a skill, you're gonna deny all the damage. We saw this on episode 2 or something. It's 
So you, if he tries to hit me, look, I'm just gonna press this and I'm not hitting. Which is a bad game design from my point of view. Because if the hit, hit connects, you know, you should be like, get the hit, not like immune to it, you know. But I saw the enemies are immune to some of them. When they, they are doing, uh, for example, the insect, you know, the, the ones which are charging you. If I'm trying to hit them with a heavy, while they are charging, they cancel all the damage I'm basically doing to... What's that? We have another skill point here, let's invest into this. Yeah, we're gonna go for this. Just to see the difference in experience. Please. Another chair. Apparently, because we have some uh, runes on the wall. Again, I, I was just denied all the time. I wanted to grab the barrel, so I just detonated the barrel. Fuck it. We have a new shield, fuck shield. These motherfuckers are dangerous. You see? These mofos, the wolf. Insanely dangerous, like if you fight a pack of. Four of them, or more than four, you are fucked. You really need to be extremely careful. Because they can stun lock you. And uh, they don't give a shit about your skills, like... You can knock, knock them down, like... Even if you use this, I don't think you can knock them down. I'm, I'm gonna test, but I, I really don't think so. Saves. Oh, stop grabbing barrels with fucker. the rest of that there is one here let's see if this works yeah. let's use the okay let's see if we can you think you cannot stun him you cannot knock him down I'm gonna try to kill this and check the dog You are like basically stun locking him, but you don't you don't knock him down, so he needs to lift again. He's he's like stun for half a second. Look what what two dogs are doing. The only good thing about it is we have like insane damage, so we can like. Kill them extremely fast. He wanted to grab the barrel, but he saw me close. Now I thought he would hit again, apparently. You know, we need to break that one. 
If I'm bringing him close to this, he'll grab it if I'm running out. Uh, he's dumb as fuck. Because basically, this barrel is closer to him than I am now, you know what I mean? And I was hoping he will go and grab it. But he's not extremely intelligent like. Another thing which I don't like is this. Makes you go, go around. I really don't like it, why we couldn't just go through that, you know? Why you have this fucking holes on your map like. Abris. Scaling gay with strength. Upgrade. So compared to my weapon is shit. But if we upgrade that thing. Where the fuck is the Bro again I'm spinning in circles like a fucking idiot. I'm happy with that weapon. With Finally, we found another one. We have a shield. So we have a shield, look. So, till now we got a uh, two-hand sword. I I like two-hand swords. Oh, let's equip this and use that skill. This weapon crits a lot. What's the crit chance on this? 15 chance. Now oh, I wanna fight the enemy just to test this. <laughs> Let's go and speak with the blacksmith. I see you've made yourself quite comfortable here. <sighs> that old hellhole was no longer good for anything. Or scarf in armor pieces, and not just any. They'll be useful for the plan I concocted. Plainly speaking, you'll go to Menelaus' residence in disguise. Disguise? Perhaps I shall dress up as a horse as well. <laughs> That's not such a stupid plan. But I have a better one. Menelaus is looking for a new henchman for his crew, but he won't admit just anyone. Especially not someone flaunting Myrmidon armor. I'll make you armor that will evoke awe and respect among his soldier boys. I'm certain you will get inside easily with it. It will take me a moment, but I promise you that the result will be worthwhile. So we'll get a new armor well, set. Come on. Try it on. Tough as Cyclops skin. Fits me perfectly. Why did you choose a scorpion for the symbol? That was Virta's idea. I think he just wanted to return the favor. Besides, he couldn't have chosen anything better. You're just as stubborn as those beasts. You can bite fiercely, and you never give up. Thank you. That is truly a unique gift. I must now head forth. When you stand before Menelaus, remember that he's no more than a raging dog on Agamemnon's leash. It was the king's decisions that drowned Greece in blood. I will make Menelaus sing, and his brother will suffer the same fate. Good luck, boy. I hope you know what you're getting yourself into. Yes, so... Oh, we can upgrade more now. Yeah, let's upgrade this armor. This armor looks fucking badass. We don't have enough money, fuck. Instead, we don't have money. Let's get rid of that. 
Get rid of this. Like 900 gold. Shields we have. Get rid of that. I, I want to keep the spear. I don't want to get rid of this because it's causing poison life. I'm gonna keep that one, I'm gonna keep this one as well. The, the different. Oh. I'm gonna keep the Spartan shield just because it's a Spartan shield. Right. This looks badass now. So we got rid of the fucking skirt. And now we have some proper pants. And you see these straps? That's what I was talking about. Even on the skirt. If they were adding these straps. But more of them for fuck's sake. That skirt wasn't looking so bad. Even on this armor. Uh, they said. Uh, Firtos choose the. The scorpion sign. Firtos the guy. The, his apprentice. You know. He, he was in trouble with scorpions like. Two times. Yeah so. The helmet looks badass now. The armor looks nice. Looks like a light armor. Still though. If they're adding more shits on it. More things. But it's, it's decent there. Yeah. I'm not gonna complain about it much. We get this one. Again, this one. Yeah, you have some. Yeah. The... We have some arm protection as well. The weapon looks... The weapon... The, the armor looks nice. I'm happy with this. But I'm curious if we can buy... Different... Different type of armor. Like. <sighs> Blacksmithing is an art that is on over years. And I had plenty of time. Master all its secrets. Trust me. Yeah, so we we've, we've upgraded this to a maximum. Now it's requiring bronze plate. Okay, but let's go with this. This is ten. This is twelve. Fucking hell! This one is still scaling better. this is because I want to use it but it's not better than this and it's not better than this because we don't have any strength this is scaling A with strength maybe we can start investing into strength as well uh, this has more damage just because it's scaling with endurance and wrath as well so basically we have like a 10 minimum attributes you know so that's why it's better this one looks interesting. Let's check this statue. Raw meat, we have raw. We're gonna get one more skill point. Have you dead answer? It was nice, you know, if they were like doing this. As soon as you pray pray to these ones, basically. You're gonna invoke because let's say this is like because you see the normal graves and this is like a monument or something. Imagine some elite boss. Not a, a a boss but an elite mob was rising up and you need to fucking fight him you know and you're gonna get the same shit but maybe the all elites will gonna drop something they, they could do it so much better you know I mean, it's a bit ridiculous but 
pistol right now. Oh, okay, we can pass through this now because we have a different armor. Yeah, yeah, I remember this point. It was that archer which uh, he wasn't allowing us to pass it. Yeah, and we can we can go and fight this motherfucker as well. But first, let's let's go and unlock that reef. Okay. Weapon is like it's not the best. <laughs> I killed it before he managed to grab it. So let's do a heavy on this guy. 132, 122. 177, 130. Fuck that. Just hit the mic. My bad. Fucking hell. <laughs> I wanna see if they patched this. I didn't have enough energy to dodge. Cause here was a bug. Yeah, you can still get stuck. They don't give a shit about their game. I don't know where was that. Yeah, we need to. Because uh, I remember that was a reef like. This woman is still beating the shit out of this tree with a hammer. She's not using an egg. Place at the intersection of both worlds. Yeah, let's see. That must be one of the reasons. Yeah, because I don't know what the fuck I should Somehow they sustain the existence of this reef. I need to defeat them. Maybe that's how I seal this place. Don't have more issues, you know? Right? Okay, so there are waves of enemies coming. Okay. It's like uh, an, an endurance death. The better enemies are getting spawned because it's obvious. We have like four shielded guys now. Five. They are applying curse as well. Make them stack up. Our 
Each health potion, what the hell? The connection between the worlds is weakened. I can feel it. Now, I have to get out of here. What is the bit? That's everything. Yeah, so basically this is like an are arena thing. Weapons are just spawning. Are like waves. And you need to defeat them and after that you are able to close the lift, okay. Ah Pain. I remember the pain. After countless days, my body started to decay. And consciousness started to leave my exhausted mind. Death and life lost meaning. I might have just as well not existed at all, and maybe that would have been better for everyone. Your time in the under underworld has allowed you to see reef scattered through, through throughout Greece. Creatures of the underworld use them to enter the world of the living. Seal a rift you have to enter and defeat all the opponents. I sealed the rift, but the stranger said there are more of them. I will have to find them. Okay, so we are uh, getting uh, one skill point for sealing a rift. That we are able to see reef. I don't know. Yeah, fuck this. Let's just move on. Let's. Uh... Skills. We have three skill points. Okay. So my plan. unlock this but I'm not gonna unlock this still we're gonna find an opponent because we need to be close to a shrine have a skill point and to test how much experience we get from that enemy without that uh, extra experience don't kill me idiot huh? I'll beat you bloody! Bro, this map is annoying. Kill the fuck out. So now fighting is way easier. You can exploit this because what I was doing basically, I was getting in between them. I used this just to knock them all out and to kill the archer. Why is it not locked and targeting? Better to don't lock the target. That 
apples. Sending that one flying. I think this was the place where was the cave, yeah, yeah. With this Yante girl, but wait, because she told us, yeah. Yeah, now we can see the tracks. I remember this quest. Yeah, so we can track her down with that uh, vision now, which is amazing. Because uh, I was looking for this girl, but I couldn't find her. Give me your money, bastard! My money. This motherfucker wasn't allowing us. Now we can pass, bro. Don't come any closer. Haven't you heard the passage is closed? By the way, how did you get past that warrior on the bridge? I saw him chopping off a cyclops's head with just one cut. He fought bravely and wore impressive armor. But still, he couldn't defeat me. I heard that Manelaus is looking for a new man for his army. I wanted to volunteer. The commander did open up admissions to his army again. You can pass, but be quick about it before those living dead return. And remember, when you stand before Menelaus, show him due respect. <laughs> He said how oh, we passed that uh, bridge or that shit because that guy was chopping down a cyclop. I don't know what cyclop. We have cyclops in this game. Ah, maybe he meant the the ones which are calling them. We, we are calling them trolls or fucking ogres. Yeah, but where the girl went from? Okay, so we have here. There you are. I told you to wait for me. It's not safe here. I'm sorry, but I had to go back. I'm not allowed to wander away from home. The auntie. I found your brothers. They're dead. Dead? How? How did that happen? The cave you went into was inhabited by monsters. You must have woken them up. I, I felt that something was wrong, but I didn't lose hope. Now, I know that I'm alone with him. Who do you mean? One day, he came to our house and didn't leave. He was looking for my brothers, but he found only me there, between the columns. I see his glowing eyes. I hear his whispers. He won't let me go. He wants me to join the others. I'll check it right away. Just don't go anywhere. Actually, someone is fighting holding her here. What the fuck? We got into a boss. The skeleton thing again.
We just need to stay on uh, on his back basically and he can already hit us. Please. As soon as I'm getting ring rid of his skeletons, he's like respawning them and respawning them. I feel someone's presence here. I should take a look around. If the skeleton is holding her, the fucking can hold her like a prisoner. So actually, she was a uh, raid. She was dead too. That's the thing. This is actually a, th this was a nice secondary quest. There are some symbols on this chest. Maybe I can open it if I find them all. Basically, that skeleton king. Oh, well, when we found her first, and she sent us to the uh, to the cave. That's why their brother uh, remains were like just fucking skeletons, you know. Because she was like, hold it on this place just because of the Skeleton King. So now we kill the Skeleton King and we burn her remains and she's free. Yeah, that's quite a sad story, but at least she's in a better place. I don't know where the... Ah, okay, it's here. If I can do this. It's working. I hate using darts on this. Look how many. The chest should be open oh, okay. now. Just so. Previous one, I had to throw like six of them just to break that. Let's see. I'm putting this in the main. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna use this. Definitely use this. Let's do that, just because it's allowing us to attack fast. And it's a... It's a purple one, so... Hold up. Let's continue with the main story. What do you mean you don't know where he is? You searched the entire village, but there was no sign of him, my lord. Am I to understand that a fucking ghost is slaughtering my people? Go on with your search. I want him dead or alive. And one more thing. When you report to the king, remember about the passage papers in my seal. No one can get into my seal. Yes, my lord. Your armor is impressive. But where do you come, warrior? I was fighting in Troy. I appreciate soldiers with war experience. Maybe I can find a spot for you among my ranks. What brings you here? I'm looking for Myrmidons. So are we. I heard that one of those cunts is still breathing and murdering my people with impunity. You get that dog. I'll reward you, handsome. What happened to the rest of them? They met the fate of traitors and were replaced by men loyal and devoted to the king. Since you served in Troy, you should have known that. Who are you, anyway? 
I used to be the commander of a unit. I led the greatest warriors that Greece has ever seen. I remember the day I led them to Troy's walls, defeated Hector, and I was supposed to rescue your wife. But none of that matters now. Achilles? That's impossible! You were dead! Dead! You're the one murdering my men. Now that I know what you did, it's time for you to pay for your crimes, guards! Guards! Stop him! Kill him! You heard the commander's orders. Take him! I should have expected this. What a pathetic mother of fuck. <laughs> Start running like a fucking pussy. He's leaving us to fight with this motherfucker. Point. We can save that one. Get up. Don't kill the dogs first. <laughs> <laughs> they are my main concern. understand that vicious band of yours stood in the way of peace they didn't listen to anyone but you look around you fool wherever I look all I see is murder and looting is that what you call peace these are necessary sacrifices and when all enemies are dead a new order will finally reign in Greece I used to know Menelaus who was no stranger to honor. Since Agamemnon has been pouring poison into your ears, you've become a blind servant of his will, a power-hungry monster. Maybe even Helen was nothing more than an excuse to start this hopeless war. Helen? So that's why you are here. She's mine. She will be mine forever. And you'll die like that Trojan mongrel for whom she wanted to betray me! And so. I will gut you! And executed all our uh, crew basically just because they were, weren't listening to his orders. They were listening just to us basically. Let's see this mob. Let, 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 let me heal her. Let's see if we can beat him without. Hey, here's a couple of. The normal one. So he can speed poison. You fucking. Okay, he can poison us. He will beat that poison out. So he's drinking poison. So. I think he's immune to poison anyway. Okay, that one has like a pretty big range. He's coating his weapon with poison. I'm not bothered by 101 fights, you know what I mean? Okay, we traded there, he's holding his weapon again. 
Drinking fucking poison. He's using <laughs> okay, and now you're speaking fire. Yeah, yeah, that's badass. But he's still <laughs> useless. Like he can't really do shit. You know what I mean? It's like his weapon are he's doing damage now. He's doing like a bit more damage, so he can poison us and set us on fire. I guess it's because we dropped him below below uh, 50 HP. Okay, so let's see if we drop him like even drop him below 25. -ish. Stop drinking that shit, you motherfucker. Dead motherfucker. I wanna, I wanna drop him like extremely low. You roll to get rid of that. Uh. Okay, so I can hit him one more time, and now yeah. So let's see what he's doing now. He's going further. Because I can, I can do this all day long. That, that was fun. <laughs> oh, this guy is like fucking pathetic, but it's, I guess it's the best boss fight we had till now beside Paris Paris was like a tough fight I really want to redo that fight you know because I can beat that motherfucker till now Paris was the most challenging one and I guess this is the second one but this is not even challenging you know I I, I, hey, I use health potions like two times yeah but just to stay on full HP because I was thinking he can do something like, like impressive but apparently he's not let's stop chasing him found that shit and maybe he will do something let's break all this object I mean, uh, fighting 101 is pathetic because this guy is not really a threat, you know what I mean? Come on, but charge when we do something, bro. He's drinking that poison. Fuck off. Kill him. Your commander, may your souls rest in peace. One of the soldiers mentioned something about passage papers and a seal. I need to get them if I want to see Agamemnon. Wait a second, because we have a sword. Fiery heart of Edna, so this causes burn. Let's see the. Okay, I will use this because this causes burn. So basically, and it's a fast one. I don't want to be a dick, but let's put it like this: the boss fight. Because now I, I, I'm just thinking, okay, the boss fight. What he had like a couple of attacks, uh, but they weren't like extremely. I don't know, threatening, you know, because 
we could tank him like easy. Uh, the thing was like he was spitting that poison till he dropped like half HP. And below half HP, he was like mixing poison with fire. But no, because all of them were like becoming fire, not, not even mixing them. So, it was interesting in a way because he was drinking the, the poison and now he was spitting fire. But, yeah, I don't know what to say about it. Boss fight was easy. This looks like the private quarters of that son of a bitch. Is this possible? Helen, you were the first victim of that sick bastard that was trying to save you from Paris instead of protecting you from your own husband. And even after your death, that brute didn't let you go. So she's Helen, apparently. But left Helen, of her. You were the first victim of that sick monster. Those must be the papers Mr. Mayers mentioned. I won't find anything else in here. Maybe there is a secret passageway here somewhere. Helen. You were the first victim of that sick monster. Look, these are the statues which I was talking about. The other lion statues. You remember where, while we were like in that uh, Scorpion King boss lair? We found a nice statue of a lion. But look on this one, bro. This one looks like shit. I swear to God. This leader has to open something. I was hoping this will shift and all the water will get drained or something. I don't even know what we did. Okay, so we can, but wait, let me see if we have anything here. Yeah, okay, so basically, it was his estate, and we, we defeated him. My God, feeling strong. are dead. The hope gave me strength to serve you. But in the end, it proved in vain. This guy is on fucking roid rage, bro. What the fuck is wrong with that motherfucker? Knocking me down like a bag of potatoes. See him, boys? We will. Fair which I'm more afraid of this wall than the rest of the enemy. They didn't attack us, like all of us didn't charge on us on the same time because uh, that was the issue. I saw their eyes on the ground. Like... Someone's looking for trouble. Perhaps.
What's the thing with these bats? I saw them previously. anymore you know in the beginning of the game they were like annoying to death the god rays within this it's lighting up nicely the the whole place <laughs> I was still stuck in here is long dead. Like a man that must go. One way. Or another. Okay. Mm -hmm. Shall pay for bringing death to this land. Agamemnon is the one who's like proclaiming himself the, the new shit in town. Oh, we have three of them. Poison to the man. Poison. This game became like extremely easy. skill points we can start investing into strength let's do something else wait wait wait, wait. because I have an idea let me see if, for example I'm equipping this weapon yeah because this weapon is scaling a with strength if I'm trying to that's now one point into strength getting three plus two we get three physical damage and two divine damage which is not a lot fuck it I'm gonna go for it Continue my HP build. Then we're gonna find a weapon which is really scaling with 
spring properly. Damn. This cat, because I don't know if I've... I did it. Oh. This was a pretty, pretty easy thing. Now we have his uh, seal, so I guess we need to return to the blacksmith. But before we return to the blacksmith, let's go and defeat that motherfucker, which his almost killed. Must be worth a <laughs> Don't wanna go in that one yet, because maybe the main quest will gonna send us that kill the bastard okay now it's way better because like why my attacks are so slow Dogs are like the most lethal shit in the game, I swear to god. Not if it's just one, but we're like playing for one. You can fuck me. All his attacks are knocking us down. awkward how you open a chest and you get a skill you know what I mean it's like the skill should be awarded after you beat a you beat a boss or you do something like don't don't tell me you are finding skills in a chest bro you know what I mean that's why it's a bit the logics of this game are a bit awkward or at least for me maybe guys I don't know uh, it was way easier to make it like as soon as you defeat a boss or as soon as you defeat something like a elite or even a special boss like that one instead of 
opening that chest and getting these, it was way easier to award me with that skill after I was defeating him, you know what I mean? It's like, makes more sense, or at least to me, it makes more sense. Have mercy! How the fuck he thinks this will be easier than he thought? I don't understand how he get onto that conclusion like. That fight didn't even start there. of purification I don't know from where the fuck I'm getting that from. if he says so we need to find that flower I don't know where on the map this is where the the guys keep that uh, old citizen son in the basement. This guy. In gold. That's not bad. He's still sleeping, bro. This woman is crazy, I swear to God. She's What one of these motherfuckers? Who is this one? We fought one of them before. What is this monstrosity? Surrender to his will, and he shall show you mercy. Like he did to me. I'd rather not. If you could grant me this mercy. Oh my god, but he is like... This will be an interesting fight. It reminds me of Paris. Oh my fun, but this damage is insane. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This will be an interesting fight. This mofo is fucking fucked. I'm cursed now. Okay. Bro, this is fucking interesting. This will be a challenging fight, man. I don't like that mask at all. I don't know why I'm using potions so often. Anyway, anyway, we don't have a lot of potions. We started this fight with just two potions. Oh. He's annoying. This 
This heavy is so slow. I want half HP right now, but apparently these are not working. Oh, they are working now. Extremely faster than way faster than before because he's below half HP. And I saw most of them below half HP, they start being aggressive as well. Dodge into the This is the this is the kind of the nicest fight I I had in this game, but it's not extremely complex because he has like just a couple of sad moves, sad, uh, like uh, attacks, you know. He has like some of them are like extremely quick, but if you keep distance, apparently. And now you have to be careful because look, for example, you dodge into the mask to, to break it and you need to dodge the second time just to be sure he is not fucking. Because that's the, just a decoy, look, he's jumping straight into it. I need to... Because where I'm breaking the mask, there's where... There's where... He is attacking like you my brother but he fucking cursed me you know what I mean 150 bro yeah. where the fuck that wolf come bro three of them actually to kill this one this one let's reset rest actually because we need to remove that I can start thinking to invest in some strength maybe Yeah, let's, invi uh, let's invest a bit into strength as well. Yeah, but I think I'm gonna leave it here for the time being. Because uh, I'll jump on editing a bit and I'll try to upload more videos. So, 
yeah, thanks again for watching, guys. Uh, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.